excuse me, why don't you uh, expand on the, uh, tell Pete about the, the way that the Bronx Environmental Society helps other uh, groups, n not the rec room activities, but mm -hmm. the, uh, the other environmental uh, well, efforts. Me, can I ask a question? Sure. Uh, you said there were five things. Millennium was one. The inner city community services program is two. Uh, the first project under that is the rec room pro project. And the second project is a project called Communicate for Action on the Bronx. And uh, this basically is a project where we've been able to get some money to buy equipment for helping uh, community groups that might want to do a cleanup or might want to do a beautification project but don't have the funds or the equipment to do that. Um, we provide that equipment. Um, also to a community group that might want to start a recycling site but can't get things like goggles and um, things to cr crush glass with, we also would provide, you know, those type of, uh, that type of equipment. The, uh, is this what you were talking about? Uh, yeah, he's, he's, he's gotten into it now, he's touched on it now. Right. Uh, I was impressed with the way that uh, their group um, uh, tends to act as a catalyst uh, for and within other groups to, to motivate them to do things. Right, this is true.